What's up everybody? So this is Sean Knight. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to talk about um, natural deodorants. And so as a result of me going vegan, I wanted to start using more natural based things without the fillers, without the aluminum. And so that has brought me to natural deodorant. And so I'm going to show you some of the things that I've been using, some of the things that um, have worked for me and some just haven't worked for me. And um, before I talk about these, I want to say with anybody, because this didn't work for me or did work for me, it may work or may not work for you because our body chemistry is different. And so that affects how deodorants and products work on our skin. And so just keep that in account, you know, when you're looking at this review of these things. The first one that I want to talk about is what worked for me. This crystal deodorant, I've had about a year. So it lasts a year. This really, really works well for me. Um, so there's different versions. This is the crystal where this is actually crystal. You get out of the shower, under your arm is still damp. You just go and wipe and get all of the area and just make sure it's saturated. Do the same thing with the other side. So that works for me. This is the same company who made this in a roll-on. So they took the actual forms of the crystal and put it in um, water and just made sure that you can just use this. This works for me as well. And so this is the, the crystal and I'll put these in the description below so that you'll be able to see them. But here is another version. So liquid form of the crystal that you can actually spray under your arm. And the thing about this crystal that I like is it's hypoallergen hypoallergenic. And as a result of being hypoallergenic, it um, you can use it on your feet. You can use it on your feet. You can you can put it under your arms. You can put it under other areas of your person. So wherever it is that you need that deodorant, or you know, especially since we're getting into the spring, and you know, and and I use these things after I work out, and so I like that. Here is a different form of the crystal. You see, this one is the same thing as this. It's just by a different company and so pretty much the same thing so i'll leave a description below to talk about this and again these are hypoallergenic and so it makes it easier because they don't have the aluminum they don't have the fillers they don't have all of the parabens and those things that um we don't want this is one that i just don't like and I get this from um, Whole Foods. And so this is Tom's. I'm sure this company makes wonderful products and I'm sure that this works for people. This personally did not work for me. Uh, midway through my morning after application, about two hours, I noticed that it just wasn't working. And so I had to go into the bathroom and reapply and I didn't like that. And then the other thing is it dried out my underarm and made it itchy. And again, this may work for you or it may do the same thing that it did to me. So just so you know, that's what that is. This deodorant, um, pretty much the same thing. I didn't like it. I don't like this scent either, but that's just a personal preference. So this deodorant, um, Midway through the day, it just wasn't lasting. It just did not last for me. And I didn't like that. I want something that I can apply and it'll give me several hours of application and use and not have to reapply after two to three hours. So for me, I didn't like this. This deodorant, can you see that? This deodorant works well for me. The only thing about this is midway through my day, I don't like the smell of this. You get more of a pronounced smell of this deodorant and I didn't like that, but I still use this, but I try to use a little bit less of it. And so what I've been doing is using either the crystal roll on first 
and then putting a little bit of this so that I have like a dual application and it helps. But this did not, this, the scent after a couple of hours, I just don't like the scent, but it works well. It keeps the perforation away and it keeps over away. And so I'm glad about that. I did a video before about a Lush haul. So I went to Lush and got some products and this happens to be deodorant. And so the same application, you get out of the shower, your underarm is still damp and you use this and you apply. It, it has a consistency, if you can see, kind of like shea butter, cocoa butter. And so I like that a lot. The only thing about this, it's the same situation for me about four hours into my day this just didn't work and i didn't like that and then it also gave me where i started noticing i was itching and i started doing this after about four hours into my day after applying this but i like it for the first four hours no scent no perspiration it works fine getting into that fourth to fifth hour for me then it started to give me the itchies and it wasn't working as well as it was for the first four hours. And so just wanted to say that. So again, these are the things that I've been testing out. You can see it's a buffet of deodorant here. And so, but again, this one here, which is the same company as this, same company. So the same company makes different versions of the same deodorant but this really works well and then the other thing if you know what i said earlier this lasts me about a year so i've had this about a year and this one is new so you can see how it's still there but works perfect like i said this may work for you i'm just giving you some helpful hints of some deodorants that's natural since m many of us are trying to go the natural route in what we eat, the natural route in what we are putting on our person, and the natural route in what we're using for deodorant. And so I'll leave a description of all of these below so that you can check them out for yourself. Peace.